Today we are in here um, at the workspace for Carnegie Mellon Hyperloop, which is a group uh, trying to come up with the next level of high-speed ground transportation. So at its very core, um, the Hyperloop competition uh, is an engineering problem. So the core of the team is a group of 25 engineers. And so these are the people who are actually designing the vehicle, not very technical things. But then where business comes in is that they help us with sponsorships, they help us uh, kind of like publicize our content, reach out to new people. Design also plays a very crucial role. They kind of help us with all forms of communication design uh, in the team. So be it a technical presentation that we need to make to the judges or uh, be it a presentation uh, made to new recruits. Integrated innovation itself, kind of just from the coursework that I had, instilled in me the sense of working with people from different disciplines. And so that has helped us a lot. Now that I've accepted a full-time position at Tesla, um, there's been a change of guard here at Carnegie Mellon Hyperloop. The team will keep on working on this problem, working towards the final pod, and hopefully I'll be there when they uh, go to the final competition. With the MIPS program, with all the help I've had at CMU, I've been able to develop as an engineer, as a designer. And on top of that, uh, my experience working with business people, working with people from design, has really helped me hone my skills. And I think that kind of set me apart uh, as a candidate, for even, even for Tesla. Check out our project, uh, cmuhyperloop.com, or even you could like our page on Facebook, which is facebook.com slash cmuhyperloop. Um, we're doing some interesting stuff and if you'd like to be more involved, reach out.